Yo, Budgie, what? They live a life of evil, bro. What's up, DJ Khaled? Yo, Budgie, man. Congratulations, bro. Man, thank you, man. Thank, thank you. Listen, this is a special one. You know, everybody's special. But Buju, I just gotta I gotta tell you how much I love you. Um Buju, yeah, I've been knowing Buju since I was I would say 16 years old, 16, 17 years ah. old. Um Buju took me on the road um on some of his shows. Buju's one of the first artists to cut dub plate for me. Because um, <laughs> we believe in you and we knew that you're going to be who you are today. You understand? We believed in you and we knew that you love our music and our culture from your heart. So, come on. Man, I just want to tell you how much I love you, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? So many stories with you, man. And, and, I and I'm proud you. of you. Thank I'm proud you, of man. all of your achievements. You know how far we came from musical and these rough streets, which are so cold. You have done well. You have taken the music man. to high Thank heights. You, man. Man. You have never forgotten wanna, Jamaica. Um, you have never forgotten those who was there with you, you know what I mean, before all of these new friends that you now have came along. And enough respect for that. Enough of them might not even understand, you know, how far this goes. But you're winning and keep winning because your heart is pure. <laughs> Man, thank you, man. That's it. Thank you. Listen, nah, nah. Yeah. Listen, you know, when we made Father Vasad, you know, when 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 you when you came home and you was in Jamaica, I made sure that I came and brought my son aside to, to meet you. You know what I'm saying? And, in person. Um, you know, my two yeah. kids in the in the delivery room both came out to Buju Bantam Destiny. Last um, yeah. my girl. I'm telling a true story. My girl was pushing. You know, like you know, the you know the, the push. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to get too deep, right? But she's like, it's not coming out, and I'm like, I know how to get it out. I pull out my phone, I say, <laughs> "Booty Destiny," and the baby, I pop out. That's how, <laughs> and, and and that's how Alarm came out. Now, when Assad was born, I called Booju. I got, I found a way to get in touch with Booju, and I was like, "Yo, Booju, I'm on my way to the, to the delivery room. This is my first son. I'm nervous." I'm stressed out, and you prayed with me on the phone. You you you, you gave me prayer and you gave me meditation, and I played Buju in the delivery room for a side, and he came out too. I just want to let you know how much I love you, how much my family love you, how much hey, we all just we praise you, and we it's love mutual, you. It's mutual, man. It's from you know? it's from here, you know. You yeah, understand? Yeah. Because you see, we are the stones that the builders refused, you know. And we show them that even though we have been refused by the builders, that doesn't mean we're useless. It means we're head cornerstone. They just didn't know where. You know what I mean? Yeah. Nah, real talk. Oh, I'm going to room. Room come like them one cut off for communication. What kind of folly I go on, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So, but like, it's a great thing, and the album is great. They did some great works, and the masses, they, they show their approval, you know, in their consumption of your, your works. You know what I mean? Just continue doing great works. And as far as Jamaica is concerned, we appreciate love you because guess what? A lot of people come and they are what I call culture vultures, you know. They came only to take the energy from us to proliferate whatever they're doing. They didn't even look back. You know what I mean? But you have kept it real. Bounty killer, all of we know. But you kept it real. Since La Kalanji, all of us know DJ Khalid kept it real. You and know, you. most guys cannot come to us. They have to go through you to get to us because you kept it real. <laughs> yeah. Yo, Bougie, man, you talk, yo, man, I appreciate that, man. I love you, man. Like, um, I just want to tell him a quick story about Holy Mountain. You know, when we made Holy Mountain, um, I tell all my friends this all the time. I come see Buju. I didn't, Buju, I, I didn't plan to record, and Buju's like, pull up some tune. I pull up a tune, play them a tune, and you was like, all right, we're going to do that. Play another one. I played your holy ground. You're like, all right, we're going to do that too. Then we put up the uh, holy mountain first, and you cut that in one take. The, so people know in the video, see the video holy mountain, when you see Buju in the studio singing with his eyes closed, that's him really cutting the tune. That wasn't a video shoot. That was like, <laughs> he didn't even know the camera I, I, I rolled. Like, and, all right, Kali. All right. Next time I know not to let you see so much. No, no. 
<laughs> no, but listen. So the reason why I want to tell the story is because I was so like your lyrics, um, the way we we made that intro. It, it's so this album is spiritual for me and Holy Mountain. You know what I mean? The message on the record is so powerful and it's prophetic. Because look at what's going on through the world right now. Right through the gates of hell went those wretched souls that live a life of evil that was totally out of control. And we said to those tormented souls, go away. Go away from us. Wherever you want to go, go. If you want to go to hell, you may go. If you want to go to... Wherever you want to go, go. But do not stay around us with that energy. Because they came right through the gates of hell with powers over darkness and light. They're out there everywhere, hypocrites and Jezebels, dancing to the devil's delight. No care of who they are. No care of what's going on around them. Lost. They made a pact, claiming that they're ready to give my people freedom through religion, but it was a devil's sacrifice. And they kill men man, and destroy lives all in the name of Christ. You said you wanted the word, right? You got the word, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yo, y'all yo, yo, understand what's going on? Hey, yo, hey, yo IG Live, you know what's going on right now? That's Buju. Listen, hold on. So that was that was Holy Mountain. That record, yeah. my intro. Let me tell you how special. First of all, how much I love Buju. It's my intro of my album, and my outro was called Holy Ground. Yeah. And Holy Ground, after me and Buju was vibing the Holy Ground. After Buju cut it, you know what Buju told me? You want the power? I hope you can handle it. <laughs> Charlie, you want the power? I hope you can handle it. That's how well, Because let me tell you power. this. We both know you know that the music industry in America is not geared towards pushing anything positive. They want us to continue leading our people astray, leading them to be consumers to buying every brand that these people make in America. But once you try to tell our people that there's a reality that exists around them, they don't want to hear that. So that's when I say to you, do you want to mess with this kind of music? Because it's important. I don't want you going up there and your, the, 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 the powers that be pushed back like, Kali, what's this? But then clearly you have your, your thing in line. And I mean... The people need to be uplifted. Even at a time like this, if we don't make music that can uplift and stimulate and comfort us, what are we gonna what are we gonna give the people? It, we can't be dancing our lives away all the time. I mean, it's good, it's great, but everything in moderation, don't no, you have, to, you, have to make music, you have to make music that's gonna um transcend touch time, the touch the soul and, and transcend time. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. So Buju man, um Congratulations on the big record with you and John Legend. I had had John Legend earlier. He came on. Yeah. And um, yeah. you know what I mean? You got the new record with John Legend. Yeah. Um, it got number Memories. one. Memories. The new record radio. with John Legend is called Memories. It's actually one of the first singles from the new album coming out soon, Upside Down. Yeah. Been doing some work, but Memories is setting a pattern because one, the masses have to know. This ain't no joke. You know what I mean? And the music is going to speak volumes. Be he won. You know what I mean? So memories of Butch Banton and John Legend speak for itself. It's basically a man reminiscing. And even from a woman's perspective too, about past relations and interactions and thinking about a time gone by when how things could have been why it's not the way so on and so forth. So everybody's <laughs> a new song out there called Memories with John Le Butch Banton featuring John Legend. The new album is called Upside, Upside Down. Upside Down. Now the title so you know, I, you know, I'm blessed to be a friend. So I was blessed to know the title before the world been upside down. But when the pandemic hit, it really bumped up upside down. So me not so yeah. so me call you, me say, yo, your title of the album. I called you and I said, I'm watching the news, and the news said everything are upside down. And I said, what you <laughs> I said, oh, boy, his album name upside down, and you're not, you haven't even told the world the title yet. So I was like, yo, boot. I'm going to be real with you, Budge. Like, you be knowing so much. And <laughs> when you title the album Upside Down, it really, like, you know what I mean? I lost my mind in a, in a good way, meaning as in, yo, my brother Budge, 
is about to drop an album to uplift us, to bring us some good vibes and, and give us that, that, that energy and you that know, hope and that hope. When I, when I man come from workhouse, it seems like I we'll come find a whole island asleep. People, 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 I mean, going about them daily lives, but they make the people live so hard that the reality as a concern really what, what is really happening, most of them clueless. Even to this day, them still clueless. I hear some people talking and I just realize, eh, you know, they have done a great job. A tremendous job was done on the minds of the people. You know what I mean? And those of us who do not conform, you'll be looked at as some, something strange or someone strange. But I see the upside down mentality before they acknowledge the symptoms of the upside down reality. You know what I mean? So that's why this album is called Upside Down. And it's gonna deal with a whole lot of issues in its attempt to get you right, my people. Because even in my country, Jamaica, with the music there, the music has always been a great teacher for my people. It has helped us along the way to understand the dynamics of government, to understand the dynamics of what's going on around the, around the whole island. Because the music carries a message. You know? So yeah. since we have lost that, who do say last? It has gone on a, re, on a little vacation. I want to reintroduce that. Yeah, I don't want to. Because wanna... this is the time when our people, my people, have to wake up. By any means, they have to wake up. You understand? And music is a weapon. It's not violence. It's music. Because if the people are able to think for themselves, we have a different day tomorrow, a different day the next day, without being coerced in what to think, or your consent being manufactured by any media house. I mean, you can imply your critical thinking skills and make rational deduction. You'll be all right. But not if we're constantly being told things that when you look into it, it don't make any sense. And the realities don't add up, in other words. So the music come to teach us all a lesson, including myself as a servant of the music. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, you, I, I, I want to... No, I'm, 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 listening. I'm listening, but I'm watching everybody praising you, showing you love. Rory from Stone Love on the check-in. Uh, Gramps on the check-in. But a oh, yeah. on the check-in. No respect, Massive um, and crew. on the check-in. Yeah, Rory, 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 Stone Rory, Love. Rory, Stone Love, no respect. Ibrahim, no, man. Not, this is how we're going to do it. Me at that seven. And six, on, six, 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 y'all and all them thing there. Enough respect, man. You know, I don't really come out in the world like this too often, you know, but no, I know. I celebrate I know. a special moment because the album got platinum, man. He want to have to come give a vibes and show some love, you know what I mean? And that's what we're here doing for a moment. But anyway, DJ Khaled is a tall night, and I know you have many more guests. Before you go anywhere, myself. before you go anywhere, let me play one exclusive dub. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs>
up. <laughs> Woo! Yo, Budja. Yo. Yo, Budja, where did you Where did you Where did you keep those dubs? Those dub <laughs> plates are almost thirty years old. Yo, Budja. See, nigga, you gotta go exercise. You're running out of breath. Yo, I am. I am. <laughs> Yo, Budja. They try to tell them sound boy, don't rap with me. Don't rap. Because oh, yes, two of them dub that. Huh? Where did you keep them over all these years? One more, Butcher. Hold on. One more. Nobody in the <laughs> world can play. No, Butcher. Nobody can play this dub. Maybe. Maybe. Nobody can play this dub. Maybe Rory can play it. Maybe. And Rory, my brethren. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hey, listen, don't start that thing up, because Rory can't play some dub where you never ever hear in your life. No, 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 Rory have no dub. Me not, me not class, me not into that class. That is too love, you know. No, still in my brethren. I said maybe yeah. there's only two people in the world who have booty dubs like this. Hold don't on, maybe two people. Hold on, listen, 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 listen. Yo, like I said, continue success, bro. You've been doing great and continue doing great for the music, okay? I you love understand? you, my brother. I'm big up all Palestinian out there in the place. You Respect. understand? Because nobody not talk. Oh, Palestine has suffered so modern the oppression. We have to talk as a reggae music that. Reggae music start the conversation. So big up all Palestinian who them land and get tech wet and I get annex. We soon, know. We don't me forget love you. Know. Here what? Love you. Stay firm. Man, I make a body move. Rough. Bless ya. One love to the world. One love to Bujabani. Give me a towel, matter.